hello thank you for stopping by um this is just an update video about what i've been up to and what i've been doing so i just got done on almost a seven mile i'll say light run i'm at the unm campus in albuquerque they have a field called uh, jackson field it's about a half a mile a lap so two laps is uh one mile so I feel like uh, it's a good place to start training again. Uh, the gym is uh, good, but treadmills, I get really bored of treadmills because um, you're uh, in one place for uh, so very long. But um, I feel like uh, at the field here, uh, you kind of get lost, especially just walking in a bigger circle and there's other people with you running. I had one guy uh, cheer me on every time I passed him, but. He was going a lot faster than I was, but um, it was good. Uh, upcoming races, um, got to get up to is the Page and Lake Powell mar half marathon. Like I said, that one was recommended by uh, my close uh, friend. You could also say family member, but who's a coworker? Uh, but yeah, Drake. Um, he recommended that race, so he's going to be doing that with us. Uh, so my brother, Chelsea, Drake, uh, I don't know who else is going to join us on that one. But that one's going to be fun. Um, I believe we also are doing the Halloween. I think it's Halloween, but it's a zombie run for San Juan College. Um, I think that's a 5K. Then there's a turkey truck. That one's in Farmington. Um, I believe that's a 5K as well, but um, we will be uh, trying to do those ones as well. Um, what else? I'm trying to think. Still still try to recover from that run. Uh, I want to say run, but it was a fast pace. I think my, my first lap was the slowest. First mile was the slowest, but the second one and third and fourth on on, we're getting faster. So, um, oh yeah, the Flagstaff uh marathon um debating if i should do the full marathon but i want to uh the, their elevations at um eight thousand uh, eight thousand feet so that will be interesting but uh, the highest elevation run i ever done was uh about almost to thirteen thousand feet that was a a humbling race but um so got that one uh what else um I, and then that one in December, I, will, I really want to do, but I know I got to train harder for that one. I probably got to do this every single day. Um, debating if I should still add the gym, gym as well. Uh, light weights don't want to gain too much muscle for running long distance because the one in December is going to be for it's a quad uh, marathon. It's twenty six miles for each day, and what I believe it's. Um, a marathon in four different states at the four corners so um be looking for that one uh there's a hot chocolate run in phoenix but that's in december uh kind of want to do that one but gotta see where all our plans fall in and um after that next year there's a Bataan death march um always wanted to do that one but uh never had the chance what else is there there's also the Shiprock Marathon that year. I feel like next year there's only two that I know so far. Uh, unless we're going to travel back to Seattle and do the uh, Cherry Blossom Run. I believe that was um, that was my first half marathon. Uh, that was an interesting one as well. I'm going to try to uh, record my, my runs. So it shows that I'm actually doing something. Where I'm not just recording these uh vlogs sorry it's really hot um but um still getting into it i don't know how a lot of people do it run and talk uh, i guess part of it's not being uh fat as heck and being able to multitask like that but um getting on it um got to figure out how i can contact a shoe company i know there's probably return policies on there but um one of my shoes, especially uh, the shoe that my brother runs in, has the same problem where um, the bottom of the shoe is tearing apart. It's not tearing apart. I believe it's the glue that connects the shoe to the bottom. 
Wow, they're really awesome shoes, but um, for it to do that, I'm not sure if it's supposed to do that, but it happened to my, my shoe, my brother's shoe, and I know they're rated for uh, hundreds of miles, but I haven't gone hundreds of miles, but it's falling apart in that area, so. Um, but yeah, still got to raise some funds to do the registration fees and also the um, uh, fee uh, payment to get some new shoes. So um, I, I do have uh, some shoes I'm training in. Those are well put together. Had them at the beginning of this year and they're still going good. Um, I believe that uh, the motivation for me today was uh, Kipchege. He um, won his fifth uh, Berlin Marathon. And that was motivated. But I knew that was like at 3 o'clock in the morning. I watched that race. So it, it was really, really awesome. But... They're doing full full 26.2 mile marathons in two hours and two minutes. So I'm way off of that time. Uh, I can only dream about going that fast. But um, uh, shout outs will be to Lily and Alexa. If you are watching this, I uh, hope you two are doing amazing. Um, me and Chelsea miss you so very much. I know everybody else here misses you as well. They're always talking about you. And I'm going to sing a happy birthday song to both of you. I knew I wasn't able to say it to Alexa, but now um, happy birthday to you, Alexa, and everything. So happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Alexa. Happy birthday to you. And we'll be looking forward to seeing you too soon, uh, hopefully. And um, besides that, um, not nothing really else. If you guys have any other comments or concerns, leave it down in the comment section. I am taking um, donations. Uh, it's not nothing to anything fancy. A lot of the clothes and running gear I do have are uh, bought at sell price, so... I'm not looking for anything that's crazy that uh, I know a lot of people buy the high end, high end stuff, but I always believe that if you can't do it in the clothes that you wear, those high end stuff is not going to make you better. Just uh, need it to get the things that are necessary to keep me going. So I uh, hope everybody's having a good, swell day. Stay motivated. If you can't find motivation, you know, ask someone to help you. Uh, like I said, uh, my motivation was watching that Berlin Marathon. And some, for what I understand, there was like 48,000 people in that marathon. And that's something that I'm looking forward to uh, doing as well later on. Not probably sometime this year or next year, probably in the upcoming years. Just to gotta keep myself going. So, um, uh, like I said, uh, donations are uh, appreciated but not necessary. I uh, hope everybody's having a good day. And, uh, you know, remember to smile.